Hi guys, how are you? I hope you're well. Welcome back to my channel and thank you for joining me today. Today I'm going to be doing an I saw it first try on all, hopefully a try on haul. Um, I'm so excited. Oh, I absolutely love I saw it first. Um, I've recently become a massive fan. So when I saw the Black Friday sales and I saw something for like two pounds or three pounds, I could have to get it. So let's get into it. First up, I picked up this pink jumper. This is called a crew neck crop pink. So it's a crop kind of jumper. I would say in a, oh, I dropped it. In a kind of fuchsia hot pink kind of color. It's, it's quite see-through, so I don't think it's really like, you're not gonna put on for warmth. I would probably put like a vest or a crop top or a bodysuit maybe under this and then maybe make it look a bit more crop. That might be quite cute. I think this with just some plain blue jeans or some plain black jeans would look so cute, so nice. It's a little bit cozy. I got this in a large. Just for reference, I wear a uh, 12 plus 14, so normally I'm like a medium or large. So here we have the pink fuchsia crop top jumper on. Quite honestly, not a big fan. Um, I don't like the material, it's so, so thin, you guys. I, I don't know how they can call this a jumper. Um, and I just don't like the way it sits on me. I don't think it's very flattering for my body type. I just, not a fan of this one, so I am gonna send this one back. Guys. Oh no, it is a skirt. No, that's right, I have a black ribbed summer dress. That's a uh, maxi that I absolutely love. I've had it for like four years. I wear it every summer. It's a staple in my wardrobe. Um, so I thought I would try out a skirt. I'm just getting into skirts. Not really like a mini skirt girl. I like a maxi. So the last skirt I brought from I saw it first, I love. So I thought I'd try another one. So this is black. It's ribbed. You know me. I'm obsessed with ribbed clothing. Me and my daughter April wear a lot of ribbed clothing. Um, so it's black and it's got a little slit here. My other I saw it first skirt has a slit. And I just think it's really nice. Like this with just a plain top and some like sock trainers i've got some michael kors sock trainers that i love i just think with this go so nice winter summer you can put it with a nice chunky jumper to make it for winter or a nice crop top for summer so here we see a black red skirt i honestly am so happy with it i think it's such an easy thing to wear and it's so lovely for the summer like i said you can dress it up you can dress it down i think it's an absolute must to have in your wardrobe i will say though if you're planning on getting any skirt from i saw it first do i would go size down because they are really quite stretchy and it's like a little bit big on me so i would definitely say size down put a little bit on the back i just think it's just you can't go wrong really can you i moved on to a blazer i've always wanted to own a suit or and or a blazer i think it's such a staple in everyone's wardrobe and i do not have one i really struggle trying to decide or find what kind of blazer i want what i can wear it how i can style it i don't know yet if i'm a blazer gal we'll find out in this video uh, i really wanted a blazer and i thought a black one was a good place to start i see a lot of people now wear like, blazers with jeans so Maybe I can try and wear this with my jeans and try and style it out that way. But yeah, I just got the ultimate black oversized blazer in a size 14. So yeah, I'm really excited to try that. And while I'm here, we've been trying the blazer. Because this is, this is the kind of thing I'm thinking you would wear, like blue jeans. I can not wear like blue jeans, um, a bodysuit or like a nice top within a black blazer. I think Molly May made it a thing, making blazers casual. So let's see together if I'm a blazer gal or not. My dreams are gonna die if I'm not because I really wanna be a blazer gal. Okay, other than the facts that it's quite big, I might send it back and get a smaller size. I actually quite like it. Like I think maybe I could pull off, sorry, I'm looking in the mirror. I think maybe I could pull it off with some nice blue jeans, my black top, my blazer, some nice like heels or my like sock trainers, something like that, or maybe like a boot. I think I could be a suit gal or a blazer gal, but I have to get a smaller size. So this is a size 14, I might get a 12 just because, or I don't know, a blazer meant to be this long. You tell me. Honestly guys, I cannot believe the savings I got this. I got eight items for 80 pounds. These originally were 40 quid. Like, I think they still have some savings. If they still have some savings when I saw it first, go check it out because they are seriously giving away things for dead cheap prices. Anyway, next I got these um, Mum high-waisted acid wash blue jeans. 
same things as I've got on now, but they are such a staple. Um, and I love them. I now love mum jeans, high rise, baggy. I don't do low rise or skinny. Jeans they just do not look good on my body. Um, and I feel so confident in these. And you just can never have enough. You can never have too many blue jeans. Um, I do want to try going to my comfort zone and try other, like brown jeans and like pattern jeans. Um, but for now, I just picked up some more I saw, I saw it first jeans. And I've heard these are really raved about. Like their jeans are really good and really true to size and really well fitted. Um, normally, I just buy Primark jeans. I'm actually a really big fan of Primark jeans. I think Ryan's had that on the top. Okay, that's slightly weird. Um, that might put me off. Just so I don't understand why they've done that on the top. It's also cut out really weird. On the top. Hmm. So here are the jeans on. I don't think they're jeans. Um, these are a legging material. So I think they're like jeggings or is it, do you still call them jeggings? I don't know. I used to call them jeggings. Jean leggings. Jeggings. These are not jeans. These do not feel like they are. Or if they are, they're the thinnest material ever um i'm gonna send these back they are flared at the bottom and i don't, don't like that i don't think they sit my body type at all i didn't want to say what a thick jean i don't like this bit up here these are 100 percent going back they just do not flatter me at all so i'm really sad about that i was really hoping i was gonna love these but no not at all right sorry yes next i think this is just a plain black top it might be a crop top Oh no, this is this is a ruched top. So this is a one shoulder black ruched top. I own this in green and I got it from Sheen and I saw they had it in black and immediately had to buy it because I'm obsessed with my green one. I love it so much. Um, you can dress it up casual, you can like you can dress it up, you can dress it casual. It's so nice. Um, so when I saw they had this one in black, it's the exact same I had to buy it. It's such a nice soft kind of silky, um, Material, honestly, I'm obsessed with my green, so um, yeah, I just I absolutely love this. This one, my blue jeans, I think is. Oh, get off my finger. This is my blue jeans. Um, I think will be so nice. This is the cropped black ruching top. I absolutely love it. I have to say though, it is a lot more cropped than my green one. My green one probably comes down to here. This one is really quite cropped and quite small and quite tight. Um, but I absolutely love it. I'm so happy with it. I keep looking at myself in my mirror and my mirror is right here. That's what it looks like. Oh, from the back. What? Oh, is it roofed at the back? Right. I didn't know it was roofed at the back <laughs> until just now. <laughs> you might have to go bra free with this one you might have to get some tape or some covers or if you're lucky enough to be able to do you know go no bra lucky for you i've got big boobs i would not be able to wear this for no bra so i'd have to get some sort of tape but i still am really happy with it i really like it yeah i'm gonna keep this one this is a white dress now this dress i'm really not sure about because it has cut outs um and i'm not a cut out kind of gal I thought it was so pretty, perfect for summer. Um, I always want to wear more dresses. I don't own enough dresses, to be honest with you, and I always want to own more. And I saw this one, and I thought, it's actually really pretty. I love the little belt. I love the ruching. I love the length, the little skirt. I just think it's such a cute, nice summer dress. But it has these cutouts at the side, which I'm, which I'm not sure about. Um, I don't know. I'm not a cat kind of person, I don't know if it will look good on me, I don't know if like my tummy will look weird or anything like that, but I'm really excited to try it on and I really hope it fits. They also had this in a kind of like a light green, I think it was like a light green. Right, what do we think? I actually think I quite like this. The only thing is it is really quite short, like if I look at the back. Like, my bum cheeks are there, so it really is quite very short. So you'd have to, I'd, I'd probably wear some shorts under this, and I wouldn't bend over. Um, you had to be a bit careful, this one, because it is so short. But I actually think I really like it. Like, I think it suits me. I think I'm actually really happy with it. I'm really shocked, because I didn't think I'm going to like this. But, I actually think I really like it. I'm going to show my boyfriend, see what he thinks. It's a really nice, light linen, breathable material. So in the summer, when it gets really hot, 
this won't stick to you. Um, it'll be really airy, really breathable. It's such a nice linen fabric. I think this is the perfect like summer party dress or going for cocktail dress in the summer or you know like going to the beach like wearing a cute bikini under this on holiday oh my god you guys this would be perfect for going on holiday in the summer at a little beach club or at like in Ibiza this dress it gets a 10 out of 10 from me the one thing I thought I returned I'm not and the one thing I thought I wouldn't return I am so there you go and last but not least I grabbed myself a charcoal grey tracksuit an absolute must in summer year, right? It's absolutely freezing. I love a tracksuit. Chuck a tracksuit on for the school run. Chuck a tracksuit on on Sunday. Absolutely love it. So this is just a plain charcoal grey tracksuit. Super thick hoodie. Um, that is huge. <laughs> oh, it's massive. Okay, well this is a size 14, large. Um, I know I can't do it over size, but that's quite big. That might be absolutely massive on me. But that's really big. Um, so that's the top, and then these are the joggers. Um, but if you are looking at getting joggers on I saw it first and you want them oversized, definitely buy them in your size because they are already oversized, if you get what I mean. Like this does say the ultimate oversized um, tracksuit honestly guys i can't believe how much a bargain this was like this tracksuit together was like 55 pounds i remember i got all of these eight things for 80 pounds which was just insane i was a bit worried um that it wouldn't fit like a view too big but i'm actually really happy with the size of this um i think it looked pretty good on my body and it's not too like too big it is so soft so fluffy so warm and thick and cozy this is Maybe the most perfect tracksuit ever. I'm obsessed with my boohoo tracksuit, but this may top it. I think. I'm so happy with this tracksuit. But thank you for watching. That is my I Saw It First haul. I think I'm definitely returning the pink jumper and the blue jeans. Everything else, I think I'm going to keep. Definitely the white dress. Definitely the blazer and the crop top and the skirt. And yeah, I'm going to only return the jeans and the jumper. So I think that is a pretty successful... I saw it first all and I just can't believe the price of it and how amazing the products are. So thank you so much for watching. If you guys like this haul, make sure to like, comment and subscribe. If you want to see more hauls in the future, let me know. If there's any brands you want to see, let me know. Hopefully I will have another video up soon. Bye guys.